Hello again, my name is Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'll be looking at the Rocket Raid 1520 two channel controller. What is included in this package are two serial ATA cables. These cables go plugged into the card and then into your serial ATA hard drive. Now if you don't have a serial ATA hard drive, that's not a problem because they have included two Rocket Head 100 converters and these will work with any ATA 100 or ATA 133 IDE hard drive. Also include are a couple of power cables. I'm going to show you how all this goes together with a standard ATA 133 hard drive a little later on in the video review. Also included are the necessary drivers, a manual, and the 1520 card. First of all, let's go through a few terms. RAID stands for Redundant Array of Independent Disks. And this controller supports RAID 0, which is for performance, will not give you any kind of backup or security. In other words, if you lose a drive in the array, you're going to lose all of your data. So again, RAID 0 is for performance. RAID 1, also supported by this card, gives you that security and backup. Also something else that this controller does support is JBOD. JBOD stands for just a bunch of disks and it really gives you all the available space in the complete array depending on how many hard drives, the sizes you have and so on. Now looking at the card you can see where those serial ATA cables go plugged into. I'll just demonstrate here. They simply go plugged right at the top and then you plug this into either the converter or into the serial ATA hard drive. They've included two Rockethead 100 converters and of course these are to be used in non-serial ATA hard drives because if you had a serial ATA hard drive you would simply just connect it right into the back of the hard drive. Now, first of all, let's have a look here at the cable. These cables are extremely small. This is just fantastic. They're nice and long as well. If you compare that to your standard cable, well, there is really no comparison. This is huge. And even if you compare it to a rounded cable, it's still pretty large in comparison to this serial ATA cable. Now, how is all this connected up? Well, I've connected one here on the bottom, but I'll show you how it's done. You basically plug this into the drive itself. Now, once that's done, you then start connecting all the other things that they have. For instance, the cable here goes plugged into right here. Now, you need power, and you need power to this as well, of course, as the hard drive. They've included this cable. You plug this into the converter first. Then you plug this into the hard drive. Now once that's done, you then plug this into your power supply feed. And the size software Sandra result is 41,603. And the PC Mark 2002 hard drive score is 1,088. High Point has really packaged everything you're going to need in a two-channel RAID controller. They've also included, of course, those converters, which are great because you do not need to have a serial ATA hard drive. But it does give you that future support. Overall, this is a great product. Again, my name is Rodney Reynolds, and this has been another video review. Be sure to check back very soon. I will have a brand new one for you then. Also, be sure to pop into my website at www.3dgameman.com. And while you're there, go in and register. If you haven't already, registration is completely free. Until the next time, take care.